Hi guys, and welcome back to another episode of Andrew's Boozy Concoctions. If you like pina coladas and getting caught in the rain, or just like something blue, this drink is for you. So today we're going to be doing a pina colada, which is a all-time cocktail favourite. In 1974, Ramon Perez uh, was said to uh, invent this drink. They say he spent three months actually perfecting the drink. Now that's determination. So I hate to break, break tradition and I'm probably going to get a lot of bartenders crucifying me for this, but we're just making a slight variation and we're adding just blue quotes how to make it a little bit blue. But uh, you'll see that um, later on. In the meantime, guys, uh, let's get, get started. So guys, for this, you will need a blender some cream of coconut. Now, this can be a little bit hard to find in Australia, so what you can do is actually make your own, which is what I've done. You just basically need to mix um, condensed milk and um, coconut milk together, like do half amount, half the other, and just blend together, and this is what you actually make. Quite dense, quite thick, quite coconutty, but beautiful. You also need some blue curacao, some Bacardi rum, which is traditionally what is actually used in a pina colada. I mean, you can use spice rum if you like, to want to give it a bit of a different flavor. Um, you can even give it like a different flavored uh, rum as well to make it interesting. You can do Malibu, but I find you've already got a lot of coconut element in it because of the um, coconut cream. So probably best to just, just do uh, white rum and fresh pineapple juice. And uh, that's what you need and uh, let's get started. So guys, first we're gonna grab our Bacardi rum or you can use any kind of white rum, it's up to you. So we're, going to be adding, so we're going to be adding in two ounces of Bacardi rum. Now, the beauty of this drink is it works off um, the two, three, four principle. So two ounce rum, three ounce cream of um, coconut and four ounce pineapple juice. So two, three, four, that's what I got to remember. Now we're going to add three ounces of cream of coconut. Four ounces of pineapple juice. Pineapple and coconut, such a beautiful combination. Okay, so now we're going to add about three handfuls of ice. Now this drink should be not quite like a frozen um, like a margarita consistency, but like it should be like a little slurry sort of consistency. So there's three. I'm going to just a tiny bit more because I like mine just a little bit more firmer than, than usual. So now let's blend. Splash, little curacao, and beautiful. In this case, beautiful. Fresh <laughs> cherry on top. Take a scroll through. There it is, ladies and gents, the blue pina colada. Pretty, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. Okay, now joining me is my lovely assistant, Molly, who absolutely loves pina coladas. So welcome back, and Molly. Caught in the rain. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you try this lovely blue pina colada. Oh my God, the cream is amazing. Fresh is best, guys. Very, very 
Freshly smell coconutty. <laughs> I can actually smell the coconut from actually here. Mm. But that does smell very uh, sweet. Um, okay guys, so that was the uh, blue pina colada. Uh, join us next time for another exciting episode of Andrew's Boozy Concoctions. Be sure to like, share, comment and subscribe. And I will catch you guys next time. In the meantime, stay boozy. I made this drink. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, so now we're gonna pour this. But Jet's thick. She thick. Nice. She was kind of spill it. If you can't find, um, yeah, if you can't find kind of coconut. <laughs>